What's up, baby? It's late. It's three. Three in the morning almost, where I am. Three in the morning? What's wrong with the me being up at this later? Huh? I don't know the answer to that question, but I'm going to bed. Oh, I just wanted to say, hey, baby. What's up, player? How you feeling? Hater? No, seriously, don't hate. Listen, I wanted to make a, uh, a video, the Alley Cat 0909, and left a comment on my last video and asked about uh, revenge and what I thought about revenge. And I thought, you know what, I'd like to respond to that because I really think revenge is not an option. No, it is an option, but just don't do it. I mean, I feel like revenge is when you, like, plan it out and then you, like, wait for the moment and then you pounce on it. And it's like when it comes to interaction, I think uh, good interaction is more malleable than that. Like, You'll be thinking about how you're going to say it, how you're going to say it, and then the situation will arrive, and you'll be like, ah, I don't really want to do it right now, but you like force yourself to do it anyway. No, I don't think revenge is really, is really an option. Sometimes venting is better than revenge. It's a tough one, man. It's, this is something I'd like to have Bill here with me to talk about, or, or somebody, because I don't think I can, I can answer this. Revenge? No. No. No? Maybe? I don't think so. I think finding a peaceful congruency is better than that, right? I had a great night. Went and contacted people all night long on Facebook. Oh, no, 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 no. I've been contacting everyone about mines, getting everyone excited about it, getting everyone involved, or getting ready to launch. Um, what do you think? Uh, so, revenge. Let's see. I'm trying to, I try to be a little more specific if I'm gonna, if I'm gonna like actually make a video about this. So, someone hurts your feelings, and you're upset about it, and you want to maybe make them feel the same pain that you're feeling. But this is a quote I read from someone, maybe Buddha or something, and it's like holding on to anger is like drinking poison and expecting the other person to die like you might be able to to hurt to ruin someone with revenge but realistically you're really only hurting yourself now i'm not saying that there's not a time and a place to destroy someone or something that's a horrible thing to say right but like if, if you come up on on like a person beating someone else into the ground, you got to stop them. You, you can't watch it happen. You know, that's bystanders. You got to stop them. And, and if it means you got to like pinch their neck so they can't breathe for a while, like that's that's one thing. But that's not revenge. Like revenge is like you see someone beat someone and then you wait for the, you know, revenge is like uh, malicious almost. Vengeance. God, it's a tough, it's a tough situation, and, and it's like, depends on where you're coming from. You know, you speak from anger, and, and revenge is like second nature. But if you speak from kindness, revenge doesn't make any sense. It's like, why go to that extra effort to hurt someone after they've hurt you, and you could find peace with them? But, you know, that's coming from me right now is not feeling hurt. I don't, I, I go through everything I can to not take revenge on people. I really do. I don't like hurting people's feelings. I've done it in the past, and I, you know, I mean, I, I don't regret it because I've I've learned a lot from it. But man, it, it it's something I wish that I had not done. And I guess if that regret, but like, I, you know, I I've been hurt, and then you just go take it out. And then sometimes it's like you find out later, like, you were hurt because of a miscommunication, and then you took it out on them, and it's like, what was I even doing? They. They didn't even intend to hurt my feelings, and then I went and did this like aggressively nasty thing. You know, I think a, a lot of times our feelings aren't necessarily, people don't realize that they're making us feel the way they're making us feel. So I definitely think communication is a better course of action than revenge. Um, and sometimes just talking it out with someone else, like if someone hurts you, Taking it to someone else and having a conversation with someone else who's willing to listen is a way better course than getting that fucking anger out. Because, like, a lot of times it's just like, 
oh, you cut me, I'm going to cut you. Mother. You know, the whole eye for an eye thing is like, that's, that's revenge, isn't it? So that's 2,000-year-old principle, but... God, it's there's no there's no perfect there's no right answer there's no perfect answer and I guess I guess maybe there's a time and a place for taking a revenge on someone maybe maybe I'm I'm totally open to your ideas on it uh, because maybe you can think of a time when it is make a video response please you know text comments are great too but and they're fun to read but like I'm looking at text comments right now check it text but your video faces are beautiful and I enjoy watching them and listening to them and especially when they're right to me and I'm like hey hi so um, yeah tell me what you think about revenge gosh what an intricate topic okay see you later